Right, after it's now half time between the, the Wolves and the Reavers, it's 20 0 to the Wolves. Been a, a good first half. We're actually joined by defensive tackle uh, Jimmy Charles, who plays for the East Kilbride Pirates and GB Lions. Jimmy, what do you uh, make of the game so far? Well, it's uh, pretty slow from the Carlisle Reavers anyway, from point of view, but it's you know all credit to them keeping in there uh, with their first season, affiliated season. Uh, the Wolves with depleted numbers today, but you know going strong, working hard, and running the ball hard as well. So, you know it's quite impressive to see the boys coming through. So, what do you make of the call of uh, Martin Punter being sent off? Uh, do you think that was justified? I think uh, when the whistle goes, you let go of the player. But um, I think it was a bit harsh, to be quite honest. Yeah. So, yeah. I mean, it is a contact sport. Do you think referees are maybe too harsh in, in today's game? Uh, I don't think they're too harsh. I think they're more cautious than harsh. Um, they're trying to player safety is important. Uh, they've got to protect both sets of players. Um, so I don't think they were too harsh, but I do think it's something that should be looked at. I mean, obviously with yourselves uh, in the East Coast Pirates, you're 8-1 in the season at the moment. Just come off a, a hammer on the uh, Manchester Titans, 100-0. Uh, got up next week. How do you feel it's going to go? Yeah, it's a big game. I think Manchester will be looking to get something back from us. 100-0 um, is a, a big score to lose, so they'll definitely be looking to put points on us. But we're also looking to keep home field advantage in the playoffs and uh, letting them score as little points as possible. So it'll be a big game for us, and I'm sure it'll be a bigger game for them. So... Uh, all looking forward to next season for them. So, so you also hopefully go nine and one next week. That'll uh, hopefully give you home field advantage for the whole of the season. Yeah, it's going to be an advantage to you guys. Uh, I think it'll be a great advantage. Um, not a lot of teams like coming up to East Kilbride and playing us. Um, it's a long journey, but you know it's uh, where we play our best uh, home. You know, especially at Hamilton, it'll be great for the fans to come out and watch uh, uh, the playoffs. When I spoke to you earlier, you thought obviously going into before we're trying to get to the, the baffle final, um, you think obviously your potential opponents could be the London O's. Do you think that's going to be good for you guys? It's going to be a tough game, especially. I mean, I suppose at that stage in the season, it's going to be tough whoever you meet. Yeah, I think you know it's um, it's a you know you got a win or you're going home it's pretty much. But the London Olympians are, are a good outfit. They're well run. They have a, a, a massive coaching staff. They have a big team, and of course, you know they won the Division Two final last year. Uh, they were a big success in the Premiership, uh, obviously come down as well with ourselves a few years back. But, you know, it'll be a hard game, but, uh, you know, I don't think any game will be easy. I think it'll be a great game to watch. I just think uh, on our day, I think we can definitely take them. If you get to the final then, what's your prediction for the, for the Pirates? Uh, a win, of course, and a, a great night out in London. So, it'd be great. Good stuff. Well, Jimmy, appreciate you giving us a wee, uh, chat today. Um, hopefully this season goes well. Uh, and good luck. Thank you very much. Thank you. Good luck.